I was back in Bruges, the western Belgian city, for Tom's Tourney, an ultimate Frisbee tournament. Good morning and welcome to Tom's Tournament 2024, the 29th edition of the wonderful festival-style tournament here in Bruges, Belgium. I love this place. The city is majestic. The plazas, the architecture. You can get around on foot, take a bike, go for a short drive. There's so much to see and do. I took it all in, and I needed to consume. I was here to eat, and I needed a local to make sure I got the good stuff. And the director, Boris Vandaloo, had me come. Hello. Hello. How are you? Good, how are you? We're in Brugge. Bruges. I don't even know how to say the city name. I think it's Brugge. Brugge. This is apparently a Sunday tradition. Sunday mornings, they go, the, the locals dine on this. Now we're gonna get down on some morning eats to get the day started. Style. The most chocolate you have. The Belgian version of morning pastries. They came with custard filled, chocolate filled, fruit filled, anything filled if you really want it. This one is the one that's most exciting for me and we get a double chocolate. And still, after 40 some odd years on this earth, I've not learned anything about how much I can jam in my mouth at one time. But this is amazing, nice fluffy flake pastry covered in chocolate dripping in it. This is the way to start, start your morning when you're in Belgium. I was chasing green eel. That was the dish that everyone said I needed to try that really defined Bruges. And we actually left Bruges, the most traditional place that still sells this dish. It's up in a neighboring town called Dabu. Took me about 30 minutes to get there by bike. 15 by car, if you're in Bruges, it's really close. Accessible and worth the trip. I am needless to say stoked to start eating this. So good. The eel was on point. The herbs totally carried the flavor profile. In fact, credit to Siphon, everything was tops. And even though the dining room barbecue was hot as Hades, it was still a classic touch to the food. With full bellies, we went to Boris's folks' place to see what Anna and Leo were up to in the kitchen. There's a pepper, salt, an egg, a spoon of mustard. Look at those marvelous muscles. But first, let's rewind and see what we got there. You uh, pour cold water and then you add uh, salt till you taste the North Sea. I, I only uh, poisoned my husband, my fresh husband. Moulfrit, Bruges style coming up. Then it's all about timing. A few minutes, yes. Yeah. Now they are not... Uh... No, they're not perfect, but yeah. they're gonna be. I can tell. A treat for me, but just another day in the kitchen for Anna and Leo. They could do this blindfolded. The simplicity of the dish was very evident. As far as ingredients go, there were very few. But in terms of process, to make those simple ingredients really work, well, that's the know-how. That's what brings the dish together. They have specific crockery for Mouille Freight service. I'm eating with the right family. I am the winner. I hope all you can get anywhere close to having as authentic of a Belgian meal as this. The Chocolate Line is one of the best chocolate shops in Belgium. It's in Bruges and a couple other cities, a family business that pushes the envelope for what can be done with chocolate. Complimentary flavors, radical style, and they give back to the communities where they source their cocoa. Almond Feline, Feline with bacon, and if you see there. Mm-hmm. Very smoky. Definitely taste the bacon more than the almond, but delicious. Ogumera, the rebellion. Grass. Like, like on the ground. Yeah, in the garden. Wow. Uh, then um, yuzu and green apple. You would never think grass tastes nice, but this is nice. May four. It means May fair. It delivers fairground delights, sweet and delicious. Stuff mom once said would wrap my teeth out. Waffles, pancakes, donuts, with icing sugar showers over everything. Boris just took me to the place that's uh, ironically called the Healthy Pharmacy, the Healthy Pharmacy. And we're gonna get into some of their healthiest food right now. 
Uli Bolin? Yes, Uli Bolin. Oli, yeah. Oli Bolin. Are they going to be super hot it's right now? It's super hot. <laughs> oh, my God. Look at that doughy magic. Zot is the pipeline of the city. There is literally a pipeline of beer going from the Old Town Brewery to the New Town Distribution Center. Zot beer flows through Bruges. Every time I go, the jester-laden stem glass is magically empty in my hand. And with the exception of one ill-fated evening, this magic elixir is a one-way ticket to smiles and happiness.